See, this is something about Dracula in space, which is just such a natural fit. Yeah, I know, right? You really do not like the stopwatch, do you? No, the stopwatch betrayed me. It's like... But if you had that, you could have, like, you know, triple, you know, double clocks. Be like, clock party. <laughs> Good one, T. Well, I, I'm not quite sure you're getting out there. Clock party. Yeah, clock party. Well, either... Well, it's a party where you're all just, you know, just admiring clocks. I, I was thinking of block party. Bam. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. Well, you actually... You can't prove anything. Hmm. I was definitely thinking of that. As were all the listeners, they were not thinking of anything else. Oh my god, I've been outrused. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, 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 there we go. Look at this. Now, either the floor is going to open up or that statue is going to move. Right? Ding, ding. It's told more than six times now. Alucard's just like, what the hell? Oh. It actually tolls 13 times. Oh, there you go. And this one still eludes me. Now what's it doing? Oh, going back into place, I guess? Yeah. Alright, let's go down this way. Yes. Oh, look at this. Goodies. I have a lot of health now. Hey, a save point. I wonder if there's a bus down here. I mean, there might not be a bus down here, I don't know. But, you know, I wonder if there's a bus down here. It certainly rings that way, doesn't it? Well, I mean, yeah, there, there are multiple upgrades and then this. Characteristic pause. Yep. This screams boss to me. <laughs> or not, or maybe it just could be an entirely different area. Which is certainly not creepy, is it? Okay, no, it's a boss. Alucard? That voice, Maria? I'm sorry, you were right. He has joined forces with the enemy. <gasps> so it was a Belmont after all. But someone must be controlling him. Whatever we do, we can't harm Richter. But he must be stopped. I know. Well, here, take these with you. What are these? If you wear these, you can see beyond evil illusions. What? Thank you. That's it's awesome. Then if you pray for the soul of your friend. That seemed really ominous, right? This seems amazingly ominous. And then yet, yeah, apparently not. Are you a magical curse? Why is the floor on the ceiling? He's tracking his castle. He can do whatever he likes. Huh. Dracula has a very, very specific taste in indoor decor. Hey, if I'm a vampire, why can't I like walk on ceiling? I don't think that's like a common vampire thing. It happens in Van Helsing. Van Dracula does it. What he what he walks on He like he, he walks off a wall or something. He's not like a gecko or something. I'm pretty sure I I I've No, as in like seen... he he just straight vertically just walks off a wall. Wow. You know? 
But then that's Van Helsing, and it's either the greatest movie of all time or a terrible movie, depending on whether you're me or anybody else. Hmm. I suppose there is but one way to go there. Oh, also, I don't need to wear these trash bag rings. Yeah, screw those rings. My rings are pale, man. They're awesome. Is the silver ring better? Like, the, I'm pretty sure those rings don't actually do anything. Yeah, I didn't think they did. Okay, so I think the fastest way to deal with this is to go to the teleport point yeah. and teleport up. Yeah, we're going to do that. We need answers. Ah, no! No, a whole minute of my time. Da, 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 da. And now we wait. Da, 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 da. I suppose this is a pretty good point to ask. Like, you know, what is your favourite part of this being so far now? I feel like... So, I've enjoyed a lot of it since it really, really opened up. But I think... I don't know, perhaps like the first part where I was playing and it had very much life. Everything was a bit hectic and a bit of a challenge, right? I like that part a lot. Um, especially because I just wasn't used to anything yet. I think discovering all of that has been good. And it's hard to identify just a favourite part because what I've enjoyed now is how much I've kind of mastered... Not mastered, but how much I've got gotten better at the game, you know? And how much more used I am to all the things that are going on. Yeah. And, like, manipulating the environment, all that kind of stuff. Um, absolute highlight is obviously going to be that where there's a switch there. Obviously, because that is the funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. Um, no, actually, you know what? When I found out that Richter was a bad guy in this... You thought that, you thought that was cool? I thought that was very cool. It's, I a actually, cool. it's a cool moment. I didn't think he would that, that, that would be a thing. I certainly wasn't expecting it. They hadn't had any hints to it. And he shows up and I'm just like, oh my god, it's Richter. And what's good is they've done a good enough impression with the very first act that it's hard for you to forget who he is. Yeah. It's a, it's it's it, it's such a cool intro because, I mean, like, I mean, you think when this came out, this would have been, what, yeah, 97, 98? Yeah. So having, you know, the intro actually be, like, the last chapter of the previous game... That's quite... Personally, I think that's, like, really, really neat for a game. I like, think that's released, really, really cool. You know, in the, late, in, the, in the late 90s. I can't... I Honestly, hmm, I can't actually think of any other game which has that. Kind there of, must like, be like, something. Like, 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 the, like, the prologue is, like... The last chapter. The epilogue like... of the previous game. No, we're not dealing with you. Nor are we dealing with your friend. <laughs> Look at him run! And then we go down this way. All the way to the teleport room. There we go. Because I feel like I've uncovered most of the castle at this point. It looks like it anyway. I can't see any obvious... Giant places which I haven't looked at. No. So probably you know the top, but I couldn't get there without the bat. And then I got distracted by the basement. Actually, I want to check out this place first. If that is okay. Actually, it's probably going to be fine. I should have done that a long time ago. But then again, distracted by the basement. Am I going mad or... During our first visit here, was it raining? I think so. Uh, I, I remember the sound effect. So I'm going to assume that it was and that my memory is not problem. I love this place. It's the coziest place in the castle. Ow. Oh yeah, the clock tower is like really weird about save points, isn't it? So I should save first.
Although I imagine it'll be it'll be a lot easier this time. I mean, given how much you've leveled up, yes, I would expect. Oh, I imagine some of the areas, the because we died on the clock tower so many times. I imagine some of the area that I've not explored is an area that I have actually been to in a previous life. Uh. Yeah, because some of the unexplored areas are going to be the low area here, right? Yeah. This Hello, little... skeleton. Need to get to kill these guys. And they get to make their hilarious noise. Oh, so good. Anyway, we're going to uncover all of this bit on the bottom. So it's all filled in. Got to get that extra percentage. It's not about the percentage, it's about my peace of mind knowing that I've been here. Percentage. Knowing that, like, you know, 0.3 of a percent was missing, didn't that bug you? Also, the best thing is now you can fly all the way up! Yes. Hello. Some good work, Felgard. You should learn to turn around. Ooh! Skills. Yeah, that totally wasn't by accident. Oh, look at him. That's my boy. Shaman Shield. Bekatoa Iceman. Hint, these are not going to be particularly great. Gives me more defense. And then, what's this one? The Ice Man. Strong versus Ice Base Attacks. Well, we'll bear that in mind if we ever come up against anything that does Ice Base Attacks. Well, I mean, the Ice Maidens. Yeah, but we kill them in one hit, so who cares? That's true. And also their attacks do like one damage to you at this point. Oh it's yeah! A... I'm not quite sure what that Intelligence did. up. But intelligence is garbage. Yeah, because it's just it just affects how much damage you both do and take from spells. And quite frankly, who cares about Why spells? Why are there castles? What? It's a magical castle owned by Count Dracula, an immortal vampire. Why are you questioning floating candles? I don't things? know, I'm confused. Goodies! Yay! Fire, Fire of, of that. bat. Oh, that's it! You now have a fire-breathing bat cannon. The bat is so good. Alright, hold on, we need to do one thing. We need to make something right. Yes, bat friend. Hello, bat friend. See, now that I've got a fire bat, bat friend is gonna love me even more. Ooh, there's a square. Can we do the square. Now? I imagine that. Oh, the cross. Oh yeah, this weapon's hacks. Is it hacks? Yes, yes. It, oh, come on. It's so much cooler than the axe. Yeah, but it uses all your hearts. Yeah, but it's hacks. Is the is the axe hacks? No, that's why it's called the axe and not the hacks. It's true. That's just something that the axe lacks, I guess. <laughs> Jade Star is going to get irrationally angry at this. Be hitting all of these in case they have something inside. You're just doing this to wind them up, aren't you? Yeah, I think so. You're a cruel man sometimes now. It's kind of a challenge to do it, you know? And time the whack appropriately. Yeah. It's a challenge to see how much you can increase this poor person's blood pressure. Cool. And then we got here. We arrest our battle. Oh no, 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 no. We go all the way up to the top and see if there's anything. Probably not, but you know. Gotta uncover those squares. Yep, you've gotta check everything. I mean, given how obtuse some of the secret rooms in this game are, it is entirely possible that there could be secret rooms lurking up here. Yeah, I, I, I've seen them do it before. 
They did it in the introduction area. Yep. Uh, where you got the, the wolf power up. And then there's one down there. But we're gonna go. Oh, and obviously this lets me skip half a cocktail. Yep. <laughs> That's good. And also these guys are going to do virtually no damage to you, but you can still get petrified. Yeah, one shot killing them makes this a fair bit easier, I think. No, not the salt! Every time we get the salt, that is our reaction. Oh, there's a room on that side that I... Oh, Mist could probably pass through that. Okay, perhaps not. I wonder how you open that. We never figured that one out on my first way through here. Oh. Yeah, a fair bit easier when these things aren't hitting me for any damage anymore. Yeah, the only thing it was like, well, it's yeah, it's, it's just the Medusa heads that are gonna bug you. Yeah, that entrance is gonna uh, bug the hell out of me. Also, there appears to be an entrance at the top of them. You know the secret room? Yeah. There appears to be a way out the top. I should check that first. I might be even, able, even be able to kill the thing up here this time. Oh god damn it. It's fine. Hello friend. Oh. I'd be surprised if this guy actually even does much damage. No, he's dead. Oh, oh my god. Nah, it was no, just a okay. little bit of collision, collision data on that spot. There you go. Well, he's. I killed the dude anyway. Good job, bat. Yeah, I like the bat more than the. Uh, him. I mean, the bat just kills things for me. It's great. Yeah, I mean, as 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 the, as the familiars um, level up, they do react more like the ones who attack enemies. Will react more quickly. Oh, really? Yeah, but I th but it it always seemed to me that the bats reacted like more quickly, even at a lower level mm. than say like the imp or well the other familiars. Did we go up here? I think we did. What's up here? Probably nothing important. Oh my god, I'm starting to see why they're getting annoyed. Yeah, well. Alright, you know what? Oh shit. There you go, that I used some of my heart. Pretty rock and roll. See, I'm just gonna do that every time I get the max hearts now, so I can't justify not getting the thing. Okay, that was nice. Thank yeah, you. okay, that's a good way of looking at it. I mean, it's not like you're ever so starved of farts outside boss fights that you can't afford to just have a little fun now and again. I remember when we had to actually like do this part of the puzzle. Oh, wow. These guys are stuff. They can fly? Oh, I mean, they're floating swordy ghost things. Yeah. That's a good point. I probably should have expected that. What's going on over here? Uh -huh. The game's easiest boss. Oh, that boss was so terrible. That boss, is actually... that boss was, like, terrible when I was a completely level appropriate thing for it. Yeah, I mean, I don't like using this word very often, but that boss was trash. And I feel bad saying that about any boss in any game, but that boss was trash. That boss was trash. No, I could fly force. up, but this is much more stable. Slowly ascending. There we go. We'll get our save point. It's time.